Welcome to London, where humor is added to red, white, and blue to make it swing. The United Kingdom is part of Cartier's identity. At the turn of the 20th century, London became one of the Maison's three foremost locations, along with Paris and New York. In London, since 1902, Cartier's style took on an inimitable British twist. Let's take hold of the handrail, head for the platform, and stay out of the rain. All about for central London, Cartier found its way into the exclusive and restricted circles of the aristocracy and the British Empire. The Prince of Wales considered Cartier to be the jeweler of kings, king of jewelers. In 1902, he became King Edward VII. Two years later, Cartier was awarded a royal warrant, official supplier to the king's household. In the 1870s, Alfred, son of the founder, lived in England for a while. Later, Jacques, his youngest son, followed in his footsteps. The next stop is Bond Street. Welcome to one of British high society's most attended soirees. Ladies and gentlemen, jostle for the attention of a young 22-year-old who took over Cartier London in 1906, Jacques. Today, the festivities continue, ensuring that Cartier maintains a presence throughout the season, from the Goodwood Festival to the Queen's Cup Polo. Just in time, listen, the ticking of the iconic crash watch. It's time for the atypical. The Maison put squares into circles and set the tempo of the times. It was Jacques' son, Jean-Jacques, who sparked the real catchy craze. British quirkiness, the sense of humor and charm that influenced the Maison's designs from London. Cartier's archives, the Maison's physical memory, a dazzling sight and so creative. Full of designs and sketches, it is a true inventory that passes before our eyes. Ballroom jewelry mixes with Maharaja ornaments alongside cocktail shakers, cigarette cases, braces, and other accessories for London ladies. Elegance and daring with a touch of British humor. Cartier Newborn Street, a very chic lady. Walls that have welcomed the London smart set and the whole world for almost a century. Today, here comes the sun. The boutique has been renewed. The timeless maison shines brighter than ever.